out there today? Yeah, we just didn't put the ball in the rim, didn't execute our plays. Uh, defensively, uh, this guy outplayed. You don't think effort, intensity had anything to do with it today? Definitely. Um, you know, there's points where they were just you know, out hustling us, playing playing those type of plays where, you you know, it was championship plays. And, uh, you know, we didn't get enough of them. Obviously, we didn't hit enough shots. Fans get emotional. They wonder if the team quit today. Do you think the team quit? Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think quit, you know. I think we're out there still trying to you know, play hard and, you know, play to win, but, you know, it's hard when you get down like that. Um, you, you do get frustrated, but, uh, you know, we definitely weren't quitting. Where do you think, do you think this team can regroup and play in some sort of tournament and get excited about that? You know, wherever they put us in, we're going to come out and play hard. And you picked up your second, I think, midway through the, the first half. Is you know, did you want to stay out there? I mean, you feel like that kind of changed the game when you came out. Yeah, I think it changed the game a lot. Um, just you know, I think when I'm out there, it's a, it's a lot different when they play against us. Um, Jones was in foul trouble too, so it, it went both ways. But he was out. He stayed out there, obviously, and I mean, it changed the game a little bit. I mean, I know you, you've been asked about foul trouble. You know, you and Craig throughout the season. But I mean, is there any way to kind of adjust to it? Is it just been touch fouls that you? Some are just inconsistent calls, uh, bad decisions by me. Um, just I think just focusing and getting caught up in uh, the emotion probably that's probably ma the main cause for me. Were y'all ready to take anything from the Texas A&M game? You know that that, that y'all won and, and do it properly, or was it all just you know kind of you know errors and stuff like that? Yeah, the start of the game I think we were, we had we were locked in, ready to play, um, and had had a good lead. But I think we just, you know, they started hitting shots, we started missing, didn't execute our offense, and we started stretching out. How, how difficult the season has this been? It just it seems like things never really, never really clicked, and then you get to the tournament and, and you finish. Man, that's, the that's, that's the way it's going. Um, ups and downs, but you know, you try and fight through adversity. Um, it's all part of the game. You're a guy that takes so much pride in what you do and everything. When you go through a game like this and the team plays like them, does it, does it hurt you? Are you embarrassed? I mean, what, what are your feelings after a game like uh, that? It's frustrating. You know, I don't like to lose any type of game, whether it's Scrabble, Monopoly, or you know, just any type of game, really. So, um, you know, definitely coming here, my goal was to win every game. We're trying to win the SEC championship. But, you know, I was cut short. And, you know, whatever the future holds, you know, we're going to take it. When you slammed the ball down, that was just a breaking point for you at that time. Just a little frustration. Um, yeah. Anything else? Thank you, Ben.